ladies and gentlemen, we're down to just two days left on this project. Uh, the, we're going to be putting it to the left side and the right side together using the little struts we created yesterday. And this took me about three minutes start to finish. And then you have to add some time for the, for the glue to dry in between. So it doesn't take all that long, um, but I didn't want to get into the the complicated part with uh, some of the struts to prevent it from wobbling. So we're going to do that tomorrow and uh, then we'll be finished up. So almost done. Thanks for staying with me through this long ride and uh, we'll hit it again tomorrow. See you later. Good morning. We are going to actually make it start looking like a bridge. We're going to put these struts, which is what these turn out to be. We're going to put these struts into their correct place on the bridge, two at the bottom, one at the top, and the double one goes in the center. Should be fairly quick to uh, get these glued into place. Put some glue on there. Press it down, you wanna try to get it as centered as much as possible. Try not to crush it like I just did. Get it centered, and the glue should uh, should hold it pretty quick. Put one at the top here. This one at the top is going to be at a 45 degree angle. We're going to try to get it lined up with the uh, the angle up at the top. Oops. And the two at the bottom. We want to keep them straight so I'm gonna move this over so you can see it and uh, if you can see that it's well, you can't see let's keep going with it let's go like this and maybe you can see that it's sitting on the there's a corner here on the outside but it's still flat at the bottom it's touching right here at the edge and that's kind of what you're looking for so touching at the edge you can see a triangle on the corner and it's touching at the bottom and you're going to do that on both sides and you can see how fast this is coming together same thing on this one It should glue together pretty fast. This paper's pretty dry, so it'll soak up the glue pretty fast. And you might want to let this sit and dry for about two or three minutes. I am not, but you might want to. Uh, we're going to go ahead and, and uh, flip it over. Uh, actually, I might let it sit here for two or three minutes. And uh, then I'm going to flip it over and put the other one right on top of it, but I'm going to flip it over because gravity works and therefore it will pull down on it. So give it a couple seconds, couple minutes, and uh, I'll be right back. Okay, here we go. I'm going to, going to put the other side together. So I've got the exact same thing. I'm going to go ahead and run my glue and I'm going to go ahead and put the glue in all four places. I'm going to have to wiggle things around until they're in the right spots. I'm going to go ahead and put the glue in all four spaces. I'll start with the big one here in the center because that's the one that's going to take most of the pressure. And I want to make sure I try to keep it as perpendicular as I possibly can. Next is the top one. Make sure it's touching at the top. And then the two ones at the bottom. When you're moving these around, you wanna make sure that they don't uh, drag everybody around. Because when you move one, it might move the other. There you go, that's it. We have a bridge. 
let it again sit for about two or three minutes before you move it. That way the glue can uh, set up a little bit. Final thoughts, uh, you'll see that it actually looks like a bridge. The only thing we have left to do is to figure out how do we stop it from wiggling back and forth. And we'll work on that tomorrow. So don't worry if it's, let me move the camera. Don't worry if it's not sitting perfectly flat over here. It's okay going to be in the air anyway this middle section will be in the air so there you go see you tomorrow about five minutes.